Hello everyone, my name is Anirudh Bad and I serve as a Principal Solution Architect here at XWay. It's my pleasure to welcome you to our current discussion on Ad Hoc File Movement, a feature within XWay's Managed File Transfer solution called Secure Transport. For today, we have segregated the objectives into the following segments. Let's start with a quick overview. So why exactly you will ever need Ad Hoc File Transfer? What makes it compelling or important to have this capability in your organization? To better understand that, let's quickly touch base on the traditional MFT approach, which in simple terms refer to sending or receiving a file from defined sources or destination over a secure channel. But there are a few key challenges here. Imagine, if you want to perform data exchange with user who does not exist in your system, or create one-time downloads only, or share file over emails, or create shared folder for partner collaboration. All of these use cases make compelling argument on why you need a secure way to perform ad hoc file movements. Let's move further and see a few of the use cases in action today. Demonstration. For today's session, we have taken an example of real estate industry. Let's meet Jenny, a new on-field agent for Hudson Harbor Properties working in Manhattan area, New York City. She wants to get her client for the company. On the other side, we have Clay and Barbara, a newlywed couple looking for a property in the same area. Let's consider that they have seen multiple properties and they agreed upon and about to sign a new homeowner agreement with the company. Here, as Jenny, Picture what kind of questions will come in our mind. Our objective here is to provide Clay and Barbara a quick turnaround experience with faster registration and document confirmation. But like any business user, Jenny will often rely on the technical team to achieve most of it. But today, we will see how we can help Jenny by empowering her to self-service using ad hoc data movement capability, where she does not need to take any help from any technical team whatsoever. Today's demo roadmap will include the following two topics. Let's start with ad hoc data exchange. Demo setup. Let's consider that Jenny belongs to the housing department in Hudson Harbor properties, and we want to enable her to be able to perform the partner registration as well as ad hoc file movement with potential customers like Clay. In this demo, we will see two things. As Jenny, we will compose an email with attachment that would be sent to partner over secure channel. Also, we will define the expiration and enrollment type. On the other side, as a partner, Clay will receive a link over email to download the attached file and also do the partner registration. So let's go ahead and see those in action. I have opened my browser session where I'm accessing the Xway Secure Web Client, a user-centric secure portal where your business users can log in to perform upload, download, or ad hoc data movement. This secure portal can be customized and tailored to your theme, as you can see here. Jenny now logs to the secure web client with her credentials. Once logged in, she gets multiple options on the top menu bar, including your files and mailbox. For this section of the demo, let's go to the mailbox. Let's select the mailbox and compose an email. Here, I have already added the required detail including the recipient email address, message, and also an attachment. A quick note here, the administrator of the application can allow the business users like Jenny to define the recipient experience. In this demo, we have given Jenny more autonomy. She can define the expiration date, which represents the number of days before which the recipient should respond. Also, she can select the enrollment type to choose whether the recipient will get a private link to be able to only download the file or the recipient should be added in the system as a new user. In our case, we have chosen the latter. Let's click on send. Here, a private URL is created and the file is stored safely in the MFT Gateway file repository. From the recipient side, now Clay is accessing his mailbox. Here, we receive two emails, one with the enrollment detail and the other with the actual file. In order to download the file, Clay must register himself in the solution. 
crypto as clay let me click on the private link from the registration email and follow the steps the private link will take clay to the secure client web page here clay can use the username and the temporary password from the registration email to log into the system for the first time also you can enforce the user to reset the password in their first login as we did here once the password is reset clay can log back in with the updated credential once logged in as you can see there is a notification on the mailbox section let's go inside it here you can see that the email from jenny was received successfully now clay can choose to either download the file or in our case he can start communicating with jenny by replying to this email instantly once the reply is sent jenny will receive a notification on her mailbox as you can see here and that's how the collaborative system for both the users is created with that let's go back to our presentation and do a quick recap we saw a few things out here first a customizable secure web portal for your business user and also we saw how to empower those business users to be able to perform partner registration as well as ad hoc data exchange the main benefit here is self service for the business user which can basically transform into increased productivity and reduced time to revenue also with this approach you get more robustness and flexibility without any kind of technical help at all and that brings us to the second part of our demo session today partner collaboration expanding on the use case that we saw today let's assume that other users like barbara who is clay's partner or oliver who belongs to the credit department in hudson harbor properties they want to talk to each other in those use cases jenny as a business user can also leverage the shared folder option where she can create an ecosystem for the partner collaboration instantly so let's go ahead and see how to set up the shared folder and define access and create notifications i am going back to the secure client as jenny from the your files tab here at the top i will click on action and then create folder let's name the folder with a case id and click on create i will go inside the folder and upload a file and this folder becomes the collaboration landscape for all the participating users Let's go one step back and select the folder and click on share. Here, you get an option to define the recipient as well as the access level. For our use case today, let's allow download, upload, and override of the files. We will also get the flexibility to set up the notification. Once configured, let's click on share. From the recipient side, when I go back to the mailbox as Clay, I see a quick email stating that Jenny has shared a folder. I will click on this link and it will take me to the secure client as clay where I can see that new shared folder with the uploaded file exists and this identical experience will also happen for all the participating users like Barbara or Oliver in our use case let's go back to the presentation and do a quick recap in this demo we saw how the business user can now set up share folder and collaborate with partners benefits it's easy and can be set up instantly which will save time and effort also you get complete access control to best select the collaboration scope and that brings us to the end of the demo that we planned for today summary let's meet jenny again after she started using this ad hoc file movement capability key thing to note here is that she being a business user or actually a on field user in our use case like jenny has now been empowered now she does not need to interact with any technical team to onboard a new partner or create shared folder for better partner collaboration all of the features are easy to set up which lowers the time to revenue and this also allows users like jenny to be more productive and effective in real world that concludes the session for today should you require further information on this subject please don't hesitate to contact the xway sales team we will see you soon in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you for watching